I just got back from the package place. Oh, do we get something awesome? Oh, I think so. All right, I can't wait to see it. You bring it. Yay. Yeah. It is a Thetford Titan four-wheel toad. I am flushed with excitement. Flushed, yeah. It's a, I'm sure you're going to be very thankful for this. I'm sure I am. Yeah. yeah. So let's open it and see what we see. Let's do. Um, I know Thetford makes a lot of products for RV potties. And so this is brand new from them. And so let's see how they did. It's big. Yes. 20, uh, 20 gallons. gallons or 80 liters, roughly. An 80 liter chariot. Indeed. A waste chariot. Waste not, want not. <laughs> That's because if you want not your waste, you can take it to the dump station. Oh, and, good point. Yeah. yeah, indeed. I'm wielding this knife like, I don't know what, some horror film dude. Yeah. I hope you don't cut your face off. Oh, that's okay. I'm sure I won't. You missed a spot. I did miss a spot. <laughs> what you'd use this for is dumping your tanks into the tote and then uh, taking it to the dump station. So if you're boondocking or something like that, you don't have to leave your spot and apparently this is all completely already assembled oh I'll interesting show you Let's see look everybody pull the box off of the tank yeah you grab the one end i'll grab the other oh, oh it's a tankless job yes it is but somebody's, somebody's got to do, do it look at that it's sort of heavy but not awfully heavy true hey there's instructions oh shit <laughs> <laughs> Who needs any stinking instructions? All right, let's see what we got here. I see a handle under here. Underwear. <laughs> so this is pretty slick. I think, no, don't turn it. This lets you hook it to the trailer hitch ball on your tow vehicle. Yes. And haul it to wherever it's going. There's a handle here, There's so you a can handle drag there. it around. Yep. Or here. Pretty cool, I like the wheels. They are definitely, look, I mean, this is where on rock, and like it rolls color. really well. It rocks on roll, it rolls on rock. It rolls on rock. On rock. <laughs> ah, so here is a, so there's a place to squirt water. So oh, it's like a clean out. Yeah, it's like a black tank flush. Oh, interesting. Okay. And there's an air valve here, so you don't, I believe this keeps it from pre-releasing, as it were. All right. So there's the business end. Yes, here are the fittings that it comes with. A valve, ball valve here. Um... So do you fill it and dump it with the same hose? It would appear so. So you put this on the trailer to fill yeah, the tank. Yeah, on your RV. And then, then you drag it and let then her rip. take this and put it on the ho on the, on the dump station. Yeah, and then okay. you would to dump it, you would flip this up so it kind of sits on its hind end, as it were. And here, so well, we'll we'll play with this further and see what we see, but um, the... This feels sturdy. Yeah, the wheels are really impressive. I like that there are four wheels, because, you know, 20 gallons of waste is gonna be 160 pounds, yeah. right? Yeah, Eight pounds to the gallon. So this thing, you won't have to break your back hauling this. The wheels are good. The All of the hinges and pieces seem well made. There's something else I saw on the box. Here, put this, I'll let you put this back. Okay. You will, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, we didn't pay that close of attention <laughs> pulling it out. <laughs> all right, we'll, we'll figure that, that out in a minute. Oh, flip it down. Yeah. All right. 
Flip it down. And then, it do, and then oh, it's not in yes. the way of the wheels. So this is what I saw. So you could, when it's empty, oh, you can hang, it. hang it on your ladder, ah. depending on how your ladder oh, is ladder. built. But that's, for that, that's pretty slick. Like I say, I'm really happy with the quality of the wheels and the construction is all pretty solid. Uh, so well, that's our new Thetford Titan 20 gallon tote. Chariot. Yeah, chariot. <laughs> Darling, your chariot awaits. And uh, yeah, uh, perception is, uh, it looks very well made, well thought out. Obviously, I know it's against the man code, but I'm gonna read the instructions just the same. I know, because uh, uh, a goof with this could be messy. Yeah, we, we don't, don't wanna want make that. a mistake with no. this. No. <laughs> so, well, thank you that right. for, for sending this. This is, uh, we, we like as it. much as we like boondocking, this is definitely going to come in handy. For sure, yeah. We can stay out twice as long. This is almost as big as our actual gray yeah, tank. Yeah, our, our holding tanks are 30 <laughs> gallons, so. <laughs> hey, uh, looks like that tank is full, honey. Yeah. So we did a test load in the tank just to see how it performed. Um, one thing I'm really happy with is, you know, it's 20 gallons of water. It's 160 pounds. And it actually rolls on this gravel pretty well. Apparently they put in uh, ball bearing uh, wheels. It is heavy. Sure, <laughs> it's full of water. Well, probably not supposed to go on the gravel. Maybe if you lift the front because the back wheels are bigger. Yeah. So the way this works, you unclip this. You take this off. Put on the clamp. Now this has a ball valve in it, and so you want to make sure that that's closed. Then you put this down here, open it up. I hear it going. Yep. The reason we filled it with water, we have a leak in our uh, fresh water hose and we put it on top of here and over a couple of days it literally was 20 gallons of water that leaked out so it's a big waste of water but it does allow us to test this now if I wanted to stop this at any time bam you just turn that ball so you just turn that valve so the skip the part that we really skipped then is attaching that to our actual dump system. Right. So right? what's your supposed because to... you could attach that to the dump system and fill this tank. Correct. And then if you don't have an immediate hookup, and then you take this tank to where there is a sewer outlet. Correct. Okay. And another neat thing, there's this valve here that um, as you're filling the tote, this eventually will pop up. So I have this open now, and this is where you can rinse it out with a water hose. You know, it's like a black tank flush. But when this pops up, it'll stop filling. Right. And so it won't overfill so the won't tank. It won't overfill. That's good to know. Because really, we have 30 gallon gray tank and black tank and this is a 20 gallon tote so right. we, we, we want that opportunity to not let it completely empty the 30 gallons. Right. But the summary is all the parts are all the parts are high quality. Um, I do suggest that if you get one of these that you should practice with water first. Sure. Just to get an idea of what can go wrong and what and how to prevent it. Um, it's pretty straightforward. Um, 
there's a lot of neat things. For example, this will hook right onto your trucks or your tow vehicles Ball. hitch mm -hmm. fall. So you can and haul the this to the black tank, you know, to a dump. So you don't necessarily have to drag it by hand. Right. And I mean, I was impressed with, I, it's heavy, obviously, but I was dragging it over this gravel and it, it made it fine. They're ball bearing wheels, they're high quality wheels. Uh, so I'd say overall, it's, it's definitely a win. So now that it's almost empty, you want to lift it to yeah. see how much. No, apparently you don't really have to. I guess not. I don't hear much else coming no. out. So it empties pretty, well, a little more coming. A little, but not much it really. It empties pretty completely. Yeah. Great. Yeah, I would say um, two thumbs up. All right, that's I'm flushed it. with excitement. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.